Jesus and his um, apostles gathered in a place and then Jesus washed all of their feet and he said it was an example that they should all love one another as he has loved them. It was the Last Supper and Jesus took his disciples to celebrate that. They all had a supper and they ate and after that he broke bread and he blessed it. They all had uh, chunks of bread and a drink of water. Actually, I think they had wine then. Then he told them that this is what you guys should do. And he said that the bread symbolized his body, that they should always remember it. And the um, wine rep represented the, his blood. The sacrament is like baptism because Jesus was baptized and you're like, and okay, I just don't get this. The sacrament is a time in church when we eat um, bread and drink some water. Um, it's like the last supper. Um, you have to take some bread and water to remember about Jesus' sacrifice. The bread means of his body or flesh because it's when he was crucified. And the, and the water reminds us of his blood. He went to the Garden of Gethsemane and he bled out of every pore and prayed that everybody would be able to repent. It's a way to tell Heavenly Father that I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do my best this week and I'm gonna, I'm gonna renew this covenant. You renew your baptismal covenants. When I was Garrett's age, I was, whenever I took the sacrament, I'd be like, I wonder what it would be like to be baptized. But now, I think of what it was like to be baptized when I take the sacrament, and it feels really good. The sacrament is a sacred ordinance, and we don't want to be thinking about school tomorrow. Or, you know, we want to be focused. When I take the sacrament, I feel that it's just right next to me and telling me that I'm doing a good job. I think about how much pain he probably suffered. When we take it, we should be remembering of what he did for us and what we should do to him. It's important to take it, and um, it's for remembrance of him.